Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Wassalatu wassalam ala Rasulullah Muhammad al-Amin wa ala alihi wa sahabihi ajma'in. Rabbi syrahli sadri wa yassirli amri wa hlul ukhdatan min lisani yafqahu qawli. I welcome all of you to this episode of Christian English Dawah with Khidr Ibrahim. And inshallah today we're going to look or we're going to talk on the sunnah of entering the house. So the first amongst the sunnah of entering the house we say, make you say Bismillah. For Sahih Muslim, Hadith 2018, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam talk. He say, when person say Bismillah, when he enter a house, and he also talk Bismillah when he want chop, say, Satan go tell himself, say, you no get where you want sleep for this house this night, and you no get food where you chop this evening. But if you enter, say, you no say Bismillah, Satan go tell himself, say, you don't see where you spend the night. The second one, we say, if you enter inside house, make you greet with the Islamic greeting, Assalamu alaikum. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talk for Surah Nur, Quran chapter number 24, verse number 61. Say, فَإِذَا دَخَلْتُمْ بُيُوتًا فَصَلِّمُوا عَلَىٰ أَنفُسِكُمْ تَحِيَّةً مِنْ عِنْدِ اللَّهِ مُبَارَكَةً طَيِّبًا Allah talk, say, when you enter inside house, we could not greet on ourselves with salamu alaikum. The greeting of blessing and purity from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Also, Anas bin Malik, he reports, say, when the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam tell him, he say, Ya Bunayya, he say, oh my son, إِذَا دَخَلْتَ عَلَىٰ أَهْلِكْ He say, if you enter your house where your people day, فَسَلِّمْ Make you greet with salamu alaikum. يَكُونُ بَرَكَةَ عَلَيْكَ وَعَلَىٰ عَلِكْ He said a blessing for you and to your people and to your family. Make you the knock three times if you enter a person's house. For Sahih al-Buhari, Hadith 94. Say when Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam won't seek permission to enter a person's house. Now three times now in the knock. Then the fourth one be say, you can do the bank person door. Or maybe go to overring the bell. Say you won't enter a person's house. For Adab al Adab al Mufrad, Hadith 1080. This Hadith, they also grant and sohi by uh, Al Bani. He said, Anas bin Malik, in reports, say, the Prophet, وسلم, when they went into a house, people they use their nails till they knock the door. Then the fifth one, we say, make you step into your house with your right foot. For Sahih al Buhari, Hadith. Four to six. Aisha radiallahu anha. He said the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. In the start every good thing. With in right. Like washing. Combing. Or if you want to wear a shoe. In the start with your right. With your right. Then the sixth. We say. Make you use. Siwak. Like the tooth stick. Shura bi'ani. Talk. He ask Aisha radiallahu anha. So what would be the first thing we Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam do when he enter house? He say not to use the miswak, that is the tooth stick. This hadith, if you find out for the other side of him. And also for Sahih Muslim, at the stone round 10. The seventh one we say, make you enter the house. Silently say, you know, go wake people where they sleep. For Sahih al-Bukhari, at this 2055a, when the Prophet go talk, say, milk this for me. And they go milk him, then they go drink their share, keep Prophet on. In the day, in a, a habit, say, go come late in the night. And as they enter, he go greet in the way we be say, people where they are we go here. And he greet no go disturb those where they, where they sleep. So make we try as much as possible. Make we follow all the sunnah. So we come close to the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So we go draw the curtain here. Wa akhiru da'wana alhamdulillah rabbil alameen. Assalamu alaikum. Allah.